Hey there, welcome back. You all know the drill. It's time again for another Casper coin update. So checking out what's happening and where this crypto rocket might be headed in the days ahead. So as of December the 6th today, the crypto landscape is still buzzing and uh, with Bitcoin soaring to an insane $44,000. I mean, <laughs> talk about mind boggling, but yes, a twist Casper. It's slightly down today, 2%, and we are trading at uh, 13.8 cents. And uh, well, I'll say, why is it not really joining the party with the rest of the market? Well, that's what we are here for today. Let's just unpack it together. First off, before we dive into the nitty gritty, let's just remember that Caspar is uh, the monthly champ. While it might not be the leading the daily charge, it's been making some serious gains on the monthly scale. So keep that in mind before we hit the panic button. And of course, a quick disclaimer, nothing on this channel is financial advice. As always, do your own research before jumping into the crypto ocean because it's deep. Now on to the numbers. Casper currently is sitting at 13.8 cents, down 2.8 two percent the past 24 hours and down about six percent in bitcoin comparatively and the market cap is a healthy three billion it seems we if if the market cap were a chart it seems i'll say three billion is a support right <laughs> we are not going below three billion we are staying there we are bouncing off that okay so we're having that three billion market cap and the past 24 hours trading volume is cruising at uh, right now 55 million dollars so where is the hiccup now let's just talk some support lines i'll go to the chart recently you know casper touched this support line at around 13.4 cent during this pullback 13.5 right there and uh, then we got a little lift off so the day is still young and the the candle is still there and uh, just a few days back on December the 2nd we saw another bounce from around a similar support line right there on December the 2nd right there and uh, it's like a safety net for Casper is becoming a safety net for Casper and here is where it really gets interesting why isn't Casper breaking out to new all-time highs especially with Bitcoin hitting the stratosphere Let's just go to crypto bubble you can see what's going on there it's all green for the month and bitcoin is dipped a little bit to 43800 but uh you can tell for the week bitcoin is up 15 percent for the month bitcoin is up 25 percent and for the year bitcoin is up 158 percent unbelievable could you believe this just a year ago everyone said bitcoin is dead bitcoin is gone but year on it's made 158 percent you didn't need to do anything just put your money on bitcoin and fold your arms and watch the party the smokes go up anyway so why isn't caspar breaking out you now with all these things that are happening with bitcoin and uh, bitcoin is still hitting hard so um is there some sign of manipulation i mean yeah in this we can uh, there's there's no limit to what we can really cover yes you heard it right whales are at play i'll say you know some folks are really cashing in their profits so it's a normal part of the game the coins that are still in the spotlights now were once sleeping giants remember in the bear market and uh, now that they are waking up profits are shifting around and caspar isn't immune to that happens all the time but here's the real talk you know manipulation and profit taking are part of the crypto dance and it's like uh i'll say tango between the bulls and bears so newcomers if you don't know <laughs> you guys might be thinking caspar will ride the bitcoin wave but sometimes whales have other plans and with time you understand this leverage traders might be getting burning in the process that's why i don't I'd advise against you know trading with leverage 
I mean, I always say just stay away from leverage trading at all because in cryptos, you can make 10, 20, even 50% within a week. Why use leverage? I mean, it's a wide ride that can really lead to some financial roller coasters and uh, may make many people to lose their homes. But uh, don't let these short term fluctuations cloud the long term vision. That's what I always say because Casper has a bright future, though it still needs to prove itself in terms of adoption and uh, also partnerships and the overall development. The fact that uh, it's not even listed on all major exchanges yet and still rocking that $3 billion market cap really speaks volume. So just take a look at Casper Markets right here on CoinMarketCap. You don't see Binance, you don't see Crypto.com, you don't see the usual big players, right? That's what we're talking about. Imagine if they were uh, Casper were to be listed there. 10 billion might be too small. Okay? If you can be this trusted on these smaller tier 2, tier 3 exchanges, then when you go to the big boys, I'm sure capital will be inf inflow into Casper will be enormous. Three to four times. 10 billion, that's what I'll see. So let's just hope um, Binance is taking a look and Coinbase and Crypto.com so that uh, they can actually put Casper where it belongs. That's how I see it. So uh, looking ahead, uh, just keep an eye on that support line. And let's just go to the chat. You should keep your eye on this line in the short term, 13.5 cent. Uh, as long as Casper stays above it, then we are in a good zone. But no, there's always a bird. If the support line crumbles, then we might see a dip to that, uh, you know, around 12.9 cents, around, right? Just about this region. Yes, the support around 12.9, 12.8 to 12.9 cents. Oh, uh, remember that 12.52 uh, is at play, 12.5 cents. So a region between 12.5 and 13, right there, there's a support zone, which I think, uh, it's really really solid this is the daily chart just so you know um yeah so don't fret this is just the crypto market doing its thing so where do you see casper heading in q1 next year early next year january february are we breaking new all-time highs are we getting to 10 billion dollar market cap yeah because i see it 3 billion now just 3 3.5 times that uh, is, is fair. It's really fair for Casper because it's enormous. If the small boys can trust Casper to get it to 3 billion, what about the big boys? So that's how I look at it. Anyway, um, thanks for tuning in and uh, thanks for your support. I'll talk to you in the next one. Cheers.